man, it's a, yeah, I said it all year that I wanted to be active, you know, it was a, I wasn't able to do that the previous years, obviously, so uh, it's good, man, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not getting any younger, so yeah, I want to make as much money while I can, so it's pretty, pretty simple, and, uh, you know, when you talk about legacy and, and all that type of stuff, you need to be busy, you know what I mean, so uh, I don't know how much uh, time I've got left, obviously, I feel like I've got another seven years, but, you know, uh, I just want to get work, make that money, get paid. And what was it about Baxter you were so willing to do this, right? I mean, at 2-0, and you could easily see, like, hey, man, sorry, you had your chance. But all along, you said, no, he's putting in work. Let's do it again. So why were you so open to this? Oh, man, it's just uh, it's the biggest fight I can do right now. You know, everyone wants to see it, right? And that's that's it. You know what I mean? Like, uh, and that, that's what it is. He was, uh, you know, obviously, uh, or, or I'll give him credit. You know, he was stubborn. He goes, ain't no one taking that number one contender spot from me. That's, that's what he did. He stood there and took out all the guys and... Didn't let the, them have a shot at me, so now he gets a shot. Good on him. You know, that's exactly what I would do in the same situation. So uh, and now he's uh, obviously getting credited with a, a, th- a third chance. So uh, he, he's done his, uh, what he was meant to do, so good on him. Talk about your preparation for this, right? I mean, you are 2-0 and o against him, right? So, I mean, do you, do you feel there's a need to make adjustments in the lead-up, or is it like, hey, no, we, we've been in there for 10 rounds. We know what this guy has. We know the riddle. Oh, there's always going to be adjustments. I don't think I need to change, like, a... Uh, too much, right? Yeah, that's there we go. Cheers. Good lad. Now it's, now it's proper. There we go. Can we start a little questions again? No, I'm joking. Um, yeah, man. Uh, yeah, I think uh, obviously you need a – there's going to be different strategies, uh, you know, and how we approach it. There's going to be uh, things that we want to know what he's going to do. But at the same time, you know, my style and, and where I'm at right now uh, will – will definitely uh, be enough to, to, to deal with whatever challenges come forward. But I'm expecting Max to maybe even switch things up. Um, I'm still expecting that chess match and strategy and all that type, type of stuff. So um, I need to be on, and uh, I will be on uh, fight night. Are you expecting more – desperation might be the wrong word, but like aggression. I mean, like he knows, like, this is it. Yes, he worked back here, but it's probably not going to happen again. So are you expecting that out of him? Yeah, man, uh, yeah, I think he's uh, going to still fight the fight he has to fight to try and win. Uh, he knows it's not going to be an easy task. So, uh, you know, he'll he will definitely, uh, you know, try and find uh, the right way to win. But uh, at the same time, he's a gamer, man. So, you know, he's going to bring it. That's a part of his style. You know, he wants to overwhelm people with uh, mentally and physically. He wants to get, get in your head and, and come forward. So, you know, that's always going to be a part of his strategy. You know, I don't think he's going to sit back and, and wait or anything like that. So, um you know, I, I think he, he, he will have uh, some things and some strategies going into this, but we're going to probably see the same Max. He's going to come forward and want to put hands on me, and, and I ain't going to bat, you know, you won't see a backward step from me. So it's going to make for a fun fight, a uh, chess match, very exciting, high pace, and let's do it. Love it. Last thing for me, uh, you know, obviously you focus on Saturday, but, you know, get the win here. Is, is the work done at 145? Or is there more work to be done, or is it time to start looking at, you know, other options? Oh, man, the work's not done. You know, I've, we've got a stacked division. Like, we've got a lot of people uh, coming. Maybe uh, maybe we have to, f- you know, sit and wait a little bit. And that's why you always got other options too. You know, wherever, uh, wherever there's a double champ or whatever it is, you know, big fights that, you know, because, again, I don't want to just give people a, a title shot for the sake of it. If there's injuries and someone has to replace, all right, it makes sense. But then just giving someone that's ranked further down for no reason, you know, I feel like uh, you need to take that number one spot like Max did, um, and then you, you'll get that shot. You know, it's been pretty clear from day one, uh, but it, my work's definitely not done at featherweight. You know, you've got a bunch of killers uh, coming through, you know what I mean? Uh, you know, you've got Josh Emmett who just come off a, uh, a fight, you know, your Caters, your Year Rodriguez are fighting uh, Ortega, so that's, that's going to be big. Arnold Allens, um, you know, but there's plenty of guys. There's plenty of uh, killers coming through. They're just not there yet, but, I mean, you know, while I'm keeping busy with, with this, you know, we, we, you know, who knows? In a couple of months, we might have a, a clear, clear guy that everyone wants to see. So I'll be, I'll be keen to bring that on. But you know, we'll see what op- options are after this fight.